straight from the lab of HBS Beats Discount. Testing the microphone. One, two, one, two. How you all doing? It's your boy Samoski. Today I'm back again with another tutorial. You know, guys, I always come up with good stuff. What are you waiting for? Head up to hbsbeats.com to sign up. So once you sign up, you're gonna be getting access to tutorials like this, breaking down Afrobeat songs, gospel songs. You're gonna be getting a lot of goodies. FLP sound packs drum packs and some VSTs. Okay, quickly. Let me just show you how this beat was made So as I always say you don't need to add so many stuff in your beat to make it sound good Just select the right instrument select the right percussions and you're good to go uh, So this is the first pattern. Okay, so I have my kick here. So I'm doubling the kick So this is what the kick sounds like let me just slow him. So this is a quick tutorial. It's not a premium tutorial. If it's a premium tutorial, I'm going to be making this beat right in your face. So you're going to see every secret. But this is just a demo tutorial. So I'm just going to be quick. I'm not going to go into details. So once you sign up on hbsbeats.com, you're going to get full access to music production training. So next we have the snare. So that's it. So I added the conga loop, which made it sound like this. This is how the conga loop sounds like. I'm doing an EQ. So the next pattern I want to show you is still the drums. Let's go back to the next one. So this is a sound I created. So if you want to see the secret, sign up on hbsbeats.com. Sounds dope, right? So next we have our uh, ocarina. So I've added a lot of processing here to make it sound like this. So starting off, this is the EQ. And the rest of compression, enhancer, delay and the reverb. So the next one I want to show you this is a the jazz guitar. As basic as it is, sounds so sweet. So next of very basic. Next off is the bass. So this is what it sounds like. So you need to be putting on headphones to hear the bass. 
So next off, we have the bass in a different pattern. The rest of them are just effects. So in the master track, I just added the fruity band compressor. So someone was asking me if it's possible to master with FL Studio plugins. Of course, yes, you can master with FL Studio plugins because if you bought FL Studio newly, install it and open it, you're going to notice that the song that came with it was mixed mastered with FL Studio plugins. So you don't need third party plugins to do what you want to do because FL Studio has a lot of plugins inside the link to download this flp is in the description of this video that's if you want to download it then if you need some drum packs percussions and the rest of them head up to hbsbeats.com sign up go to the product page and you're going to see a lot of products to download okay so i added another piano So that's just the piano I added so I bounced it to wave so guys enjoy the beats <laughs> Some 